Hey guys, it's me, the Earthshack Knight. Welcome to the video. In this video, I'll be partially reviewing the Android 8.0 Oreo on the Elite Coil Max 2. And also, we'll be showing you the features. So, let's get started. <laughs> So now coming to the design aspects of Oreo, the notification panel has been tweaked a bit where the now backdrop is white in color and also the notification have been a bit redesigned and also this is the new launcher coming with the Pixel 2, the new Android Oreo launcher as you can see. It's pretty good and the icons also have been redesigned now the icons are square the stock icons so here is the Google now if you swipe left and also coming to the settings the settings menu has also been redesigned where previously it was cluttered and no good and now it is properly redesigned for example in securities you now have a lot of new options coming to the fluidity the omni rom here is damn smooth and there are no serious bugs and it's smooth let's now speak about the features of oreo as i said before the notification panel has been tweaked a lot and also notification of an app is now in a place and is not cluttered as you can see here and now coming to the settings here you can see th the setting menu has also been tweaked a bit and now coming to the apps and notification you can now control the notifications and app permissions per app and is now in an order so now coming to about device sorry it's not about device now it's call system and now it's also been redesigned as you can see here now the benchmarks here on screen is the geekbench of android nougat on the lima eco le max 2 and now this is the score of android oreo on the equally max 2 as you can see the score has come down a bit fairly because it's becoming old the phone is becoming old and all the hardware the hardware is also becoming old so here we can just pause the video and look for the geekbench results Here are the scores compared to the previous Android flagships on Oreo. Now coming to the pros. This is the latest Android on the Elico Ali Max 2 and also has the latest security patch update from Google and the experience is pretty smooth and also has little to less known bugs so and this rom is known as the omni rom where you will be having some flexibility on customization and now speaking about the cons of this rom that is you won't be able to have the vivo lt till the final build and also the camera is not working properly and sometimes the setting app crashes by the way guys this is not the final build of the android oreo for the elico Eli max 2 i will link the final version and also this version of rom down in the description below 
so now let's go to the fingerprint scanner test and uh, compared to the flagship this year the fingerprint scanner is very very ages old it doesn't recognize the fingerprint properly and also it is tad bit very slow it takes one to two seconds to register the fingerprint coming to the battery optimization on this rom it has been somewhat degraded compared to earlier i used to get the screen on time of four hours but on this rom i barely get about three hours and 30 minutes or three more three hours or 45 minutes screen on time so that's there so let's now finish the video with the final boot up time of this rom so it takes about an around 21 to 22 seconds that's a bit okay so that is there so thank you for watching this video guys stay subscribed stay techy follow us on instagram and twitter and also subscribe to the channel peace out